The new headquarters for a company and dozens of new jobs are coming to a local county. The reason, they say, this was the place they needed to be. You're watching CBS 47 Action News at 5. Coverage you can count on. New jobs are coming to our area. Florida Governor Rick Scott cut the ribbon on a new company's headquarters in Ponte Vedra Beach. Action News' Deanna Bettineshi shows us who's moving in and why they chose St. John's County. The CEO for Advanced Disposal said he could have brought his business to other larger cities like Atlanta, but he chose right here in St. John's County because of the success of other businesses and also because corporate taxes in Florida are lower. Any day they're adding jobs, it's a good day for Florida. Governor Rick Scott announced the addition of 85 jobs in St. John's County with advanced disposal. And this is an exciting day for us, exciting day to, to be able to continue our presence here in Florida and actually across the eastern United States. Finding and keeping a job isn't as easy as it used to be. That's why neighbors like E. Katrina are happy a company hired her. And I want to say thank you to everyone who made it possible for me. People who interviewed me, people who made a decision to hire me, and people who gave me a opportunity to be a part of this family. Governor Scott said says it's businesses like Advanced Disposal that have helped the St. John's County unemployment rate drop from 9.7 to 5.5. Governor Scott says it's also helping to get to a goal of adding 700,000 jobs in seven years. He said after today, we're halfway there. The Florida unemployment rate is at 7.1, and Governor Scott hopes when the new unemployment numbers come out this month that they'll be even lower. In St. John's County, Deanna Betneshi, Action News. The next round of unemployment numbers for Florida are due out July 19th. There are more than a thousand fewer National Guard employees at work today. That's because automatic spending cuts went into effect for the Department of Defense. Guard members will be furloughed every Monday through September. Florida Governor Rick Scott visited Ponte Vedra Beach today. Channel 4's Ashley Mitchum took that time to ask the governor about these cuts. Governor Rick Scott was in town today talking about 85 new jobs coming to the company, Advanced Disposal and Nocatee. While that's great news for St. John's County, there are 1,000 National Guard employees around the state getting hit with cutbacks. Employees will lose a big chunk of their paycheck. All right, Governor Rick Scott paid Ponte Vedra a visit today announcing the relocation of Advanced Disposal, Disposal's corporate headquarters there. The governor stopped by to help cut the ribbon to the new facility. Recently, that company merged with two other waste service companies, so the merger makes Advanced, Dis excuse me, Advanced Disposal the largest privately owned waste services company in the entire country. In a little over two years, the unemployment rate in our state has gone from 11.1 to 7.1%. And it's, it's because of companies like Advanced Disposal that are, who are growing in the state, expanding the state, moving corporate offices into the state or around the state. Advanced Disposal plans to add 85 jobs and invest $4 million here as part of its expansion.